Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Study Planet. I'm Twisha this side, and today we are gonna cover something interesting in today's video. And also, there's an activity waiting for you all. So let's start with today's video and watch the video till the end. So today we will see that how do we write a good poem, right? So we are gonna discuss some important points for writing a good poem. And we're gonna follow some steps while writing the poem. Okay, so now there are some important points. So the poem is attractive when it is rhyming, right? If it is rhyming, it means that the poem is attractive. Okay, then it should have a beauty of words. So beauty of words means that the words should be very beautiful, like not so dull words like whatever and the words beauty of words means the words should be beautiful right so how beautiful like nature you can say birds you can say these kind of beautiful words should be there in your poem then the words should be attractive not by the font but by the by their own meaning right like nature nature is a beautiful word on its own so it is attractive okay so that way now while presenting it should look attractive okay so when you're presenting someone your poem there you can use your fonts and everything but first the poem should have a beautiful meaning and it should also have a link so these two important points are there due to which the viewers or the readers attract and when you are when you have done that the design should be attractive okay if the design is very dull the viewer or the reader will say that i don't want to read this poem because this is very dull the, the font or the designing looks very dull now let's see an example poem on nature the chirping of birds in the mountains goats roaming in herds Birds racing in the sky, having fun and flying high. Flowers blooming, making nature fragrant. Animals and birds drinking water from lakes. Okay, so this is a, this is a beautiful poem, right? And it is represented also very colorful. Okay, it's very colorfully represented. So that's how you can represent the poem, and that's how you can write a poem. Now let's see some. Four steps, okay, to write the poem. The first step is the topic, okay. So you all need to understand the topic, okay. Now what is topic? First we need to decide that on which topic are we going to write, okay. So for example, in this poem, the topic was nature. So I'm gonna write on nature, right? So you can see all the lines that the chirping of birds, mountains, birds, again. Then flying, flowers, nature, animals, lakes. So you can see all these words that these are related to nature. So that way you need to find one topic on which you will write. Okay. So once you're done with that, next step you want to do is, you have to do is lines on your topic. Okay. Write some lines about your topic so that you don't face any difficulties while writing the poem. So when you're writing the poem, don't uh, just think and just write it. Just first write some lines, like four to five lines if you want to make a ten line poem, five line poem, whatever. Right, so you can write four to five lines on your topic if you want a short poem. But if you want a long poem, you can write at least ten points. Right, so for that poem, I have read, had written birds are chirping, birds are flying, flowers are blooming and then animals are drinking water so these are the four points which i wrote before making this poem so these these all words and these all lines are very important before making a poem right once you have written all the lines next you have to make a rhyme okay so there should be a rhyming scheme in your poem so like you can see birds and herds is a rhyme okay so see i know that birds is rhyming with herds so i had made a line in the mountains goats roaming in herds right 
so that way you can see how be what beauty is there in the rhyme then next rhyme i made for the sky okay birds racing in the sky and flying high so i had written the line birds are flying so that way i made birds racing okay so this makes the poem more funny and more beautiful then having fun and flying high then you have fragrant and stagnant okay so they both are also again rhyming so that way you can make your third step use your third step next the last and the most important step which you all need to do is link the poem now once you have made your rhymes now next step which is very very important is to make a link between all the things like the chirping of birds in the mountains goats roaming in herds okay so you can see a link between the whole poem that once you have told about the birds then you have, you have moved on the mountains then you moved again on the birds okay but you are telling about the birds flying then you have come upon the flowers then you have come upon to the animals and birds who are what drinking the water so there should be a link between okay and then the last thing you need to do is just uh, maintain the link between all the lines and choose a topic choose the topic for the uh, whole poem the title for the poem okay so just that you all need to do only four steps very easy steps if you follow all these you have a good poem with you right so that way uh, we come to an end of the video so here's a task for everyone right so it's a very easy task i know i gave a activity in my last video of japanese right so everyone was shy and didn't record any kind of video so today i'm here with another kind of task and that's very easy right so what you just need to do is write a poem by following all the steps which i have told you all then you write you need to write your name that's pretty optional if you want to write okay then you have to write the name of the poem the title of the poem and obviously you need to write the whole poem which you have written here is the link for uploading your poem J right you can just type it out okay on the web browser or on the link right i'm going to share this link in the description so please attempt this activity right so thank you everyone for watching hope you like this video please like share and subscribe my channel thank you have a nice day and make sure you attend the activity at the end thank you